Hello there, this is Dave Allen and we'll have a look at our for again to see what we can do with it. And uh, one of the things I quite like about it is the create omnifocus tasks. So let's go into Alfred and start typing in some codes there and get things moving. So let's start with OFNAW and we can create an omnifocus task. Now if I put in the uh, next words as the title of the task, so let's press enter. That should open up OmniFocus and I'll have a new task in there. So the uh, the quick entry thing's put in there and you can see that we've already got the title of the task in there and I can add the project and context to it if I wish. Now say that I'm uh, working on something over in Safari and I want to do something with a web page or remind myself of something. What I can do is I can do the command spacebar to get into Alfred again and I can start doing the OF Safari. So I'd have to type all of it in, OF and then SA, that's enough to get me going. And then press enter. And once again, that is going to open up OmniFocus and get me started with a new entry in the inbox. So let's click on save on that there. And the same thing works again with the Chrome. So there's three different ways of putting in new OmniFocus tasks. Now another thing that's pretty good is to go and have a look and see what you can do with Evernote. As you can see, I've got a few hotkeys in this one here. So let's go with Shift. Now shift, option, command and T. If I just start typing in there, that's going to put a new note into Evernote of whatever I put into this typing in area here. So let's just uh, say hello for the moment. Press enter and that will be sent into Evernote. Let's have a look at this here. So we've got a new note from clipboard. So let's get something on the clipboard first of all. Let's uh, grab this here and press copy. And now we'll do shift. Option Command and Y. And I've got a notification already that the stuff I had in the clipboard has already gone into Evernote. Let's go into Evernote so I can just prove that uh, is actually what's happened there. So let's go to Evernote. So there you go, there's the one that was called Hello. And there's the one that puts whatever was in the clipboard into Evernote. Let's go into Alfred once more and type in EN and we can start doing a search on Evernote. EN, put that in there. It's saying no results at the moment, but we know that it's in there. So why is it not searching for it? Well, it just goes to show these workflows are not quite as good as you might imagine. Um, okay, so if I type EN and then the word new, no space in between, that gives me a chance to do a new note from clipboard, a new note from text selection, or a new note from finder selected file. So I've got to select a file in finder first. We'll use this one, a picture. And it's a picture of some hailstones at the campsite. Note from finder from selected file, press enter. And that has gone in because I've had the notification from it. So let's just go into Evernote and you can see there's that image that I was looking at in the finder and it's now in Evernote as well. Cool or what? If I want to, what I can do is I can tell it to do type note and then whatever I put into this will go into Evernote. So there you go, that's how you can use Alfred to put stuff into OmniFocus and into Evernote. And we'll have a look more of these in a later video. Thanks for watching the video and why don't you check out the other videos. Here's two of them. There's one video there and one video there that you can click on and go and have a look at now. And don't forget that you can also subscribe. Talk to you again soon. Bye bye now.